We've been working on developing a differential diagnosis system for the most common neurodegenerative disorders and the system is called Structural Abnormality Index Map or STAN maps. Basically the idea is uh, there are three common neurodegenerative disorders Alzheimer's disease, frontotemporal lobar dementia and Lewy body disease. So our idea is given a patient's MRI scan and it's not really clear what the person has because it's early on in their disease process as well as there's a great uncertainty because they're mixed dementia cases. A person can have more than one dementia cause. So is there a way given their MRI scan you could tell that this person most likely has Alzheimer's disease or Lewy body disease or frontotemporal dementia. So the idea of the uh, system was to provide, dif provide a differential diagnosis. So the developed system is trying to establish a direct relationship between the gold standard in dementia diagnosis which is post-mortem brains and anti-mortem before death MRI scans. So we looked at the before death MRI scans and tried to look at and detect the structural regions which are very different between these three common dementia types TLB, FTLD and Alzheimer's disease. And once we found out that specific regions are unique to each dementia disorder you could go back and given a new incoming scan you could probably say with some probability that this person might have Alzheimer's disease. It's just a proof of concept more like is is it are the regions of in the brain structurally really different based on the symptoms a person has so it's a proof of concept it really works well we saw that there are differences and it could possibly be used for future differential diagnosis of new patients the early results indicate that uh, the accuracy is around 75 to 80 percent but we need to test it further and test it on a large number of people and see if it really works or not but it's really promising and we hope uh, we can make a difference.